Well, hello there, Stuart Tickies. Today we're going to have a look around my brand new office. Why? Because it's brand new and I want to show it off. Simple as that. Right, so basically this is going to be a video about my setup. I've just recently acquired a new desk. I re reorganized this back room. You'll know from videos in the past that uh, I used to be stuck in a different room. This is a new room, a bit lighter, brighter. I love it, so I want to show it off. Right, so let's start right now. I'm going to use this camera here. And I'm going to base out here. Right, so that is my desk. That is what... I look at when I'm doing videos. But I'm going to show you the rest of them first. So here we are. This is us walking in. That is uh that's our couch. Ignore the cushions, it's just a little bit of a uh, little added nuance. We like I like different colours. That is little well, a little space for my daughter to have her dinner. And we have here, we have an IKEA lamp, um, which uh, is controlled by Alexa. Alexa, turn on the family room lights. They're already on. Right, so coming around here, this is my TV unit, all from IKEA. This is me when I'm watching the TV. Pretty cool. Got this as well from IKEA. This is really, really, it's great. It's a little poofy. Poofy, put your feet on. That's my sound system, Onkia. It's a few years old now. It is the NR515. And set up with my old LG TV. Anyway, go around here. This is where my son plays his PlayStation. I showed you this in uh, earlier videos actually, but this is an old monitor which I converted using a DVI to HDMI converter done a video on that, I'll put the link on the screen, and it works really, really well with PlayStation. And I've got some creative USB speakers for it as well. Really, really is a really nifty setup if you want to do it on the budget. And he sits there and plays his PlayStation, he's very, very happy. Right, so this is my setup. Now, the desk you see is from Ikea, it's called a Freddy. And it's a cracking little desk, gotta be honest, it's a big desk. Okay, I'll go from the top. These are, let's see, they are newer, newer, is that how you pronounce it? Newer um, LED lights, I've got two of them. One, two, they're all set up uh, with smart plugs as well. Um, couple of clamps keep them in there we've that is my LG PK5 speaker I've done a review on that as well I've got an LG PK7 coming up shortly box from a fire 7 tablet which I got from my kid a couple of these from Ikea these are great great little um, storage boxes things spare keyboard that doesn't work well this key doesn't work and that key doesn't work so that's why I had to replace it. That's my Captain America. Right, now we've got our Orby voice, done a review on that. And it's also a router, Alexa as well, it's ideal. That is random rubbish. That's uh, spare parts from the desk, extra stuff and everything else. Right, we've got, you'll if you've watched my last video, that is the ESDDI ring light, ideal ring light, and that is my Canon M6 camera. And it is on a clamp, it is a newer clamp. Let's see if we can turn that down. There we go, and it's a newer clamp, and it's a permanent fixture, and it's ideal, it just stays there all the time. That's set up with a uh, smart plug as well. So I can turn it off and on and off with my voice. That is a BenQ monitor, 24 inch. 100 bucks. Don't have to spend a lot on monitors, ideal. Uh, they are the Bluetooth headphones that I'm using right now. 
uh, MPOW H20s. Uh, I think I've done a review on that, and I've definitely done an unboxing. Couple of random cables that I've got lying around that I can just quick access to. And moving down, we've got a Nintendo Switch, uh, extra um, paddle controller. Now that's actually set up through that monitor as well. I'll show you that just in a second. That's my Mac Mini late 2014, is it? Yeah, late 2014, it's just a mid-range model. It really is needing upgraded. What I've got attached to that is, that's an SSD, it's, it's uh, connected through USB and that's basically my, my system. I don't, I use the hard drive and that for backup for that, uh, but that means I can take that, I can plug it into any uh, basically any Mac and boot off of that so it's it's at the moment I've got it crudely set up here but I can plug that into my MacBook Pro as well and uh, do editing and anything else I want to do on it. Next to that we've got here is basically that's the charger for the batteries for my Canon. This here is a little HDMI switch so if I switch that there and connect this there we go you've now got my Nintendo Switch and then all I've got to do is switch that back it takes a couple of seconds there we go and I've now got my Mac Mini ideal the microphone I've got set up here is the Samsung SEQ2U microphone, which is on the Samsung uh, SEBL3 boom stand, like so. Down here, I've just purchased that actually, that is a safe move tower extension, basically. Quick tip, actually. What's good about that is actually you've got you can plug off, plug on and off every four sockets. Uh, and I think it's got 14 sockets on it. It's also got a USB as well. Not that I really need that, but a good tip is to label all your plugs. Very good tip. That's the best tip I can give you, and that way you know exactly what plug is which because it gets very very complicated when you're dealing with that amount of connections. Uh, well, what I've also got here is a USB, <coughs> what's it called, a USB Nord Marquee, USB Nord Marquee, um, and it's just, I actually bought that thinking that I can put it into my Mac Mini, but it's not, it's literally just into a plug, so all they do is charge off it, a little bit disappointed, I thought I could, as I say, use an extension for that, but it's still very handy to have, and I think that is it. That is it, I think. Oh, and I forgot to mention what I was filming on. I was filming on uh, iPhone 10. This is a Joby, what is it? A Joby? It's a Joby. It's a Joby 3K stand, and it's also the Joby SB015 ball head. It's on top of that. Pretty cool, I like it. That's just an arm, standard cheapy arm thing and it's got a Rode Video Micro microphone on top of it, plugged in, obviously now through a dongle. Thank you, Apple, uh, which is not ideal. But there you go, what can you do? So there you have it. Uh, if you're looking for any of the things that I've got in my office, if you're interested in them, um, I'll put the links in the description for you, just for your own convenience. And that's it. So I've always wanted to do that little uh, tour of my setup. Very, very proud of it. I love it. I must admit, it's taken me, what, two and a half years to get here. And I am absolutely love it. If, you, oh, I'm one of, if you're one of my older subscribers, you'll remember what it used to be like up in the attic. It used to be terrible. It used to be really hot in the summer, really cold in the winter. This is pure and utter luxury. It really is. I'm really, really happy with it. I hope you enjoy the videos from this setup. I certainly enjoy making them here so much easier. I really can just plug and play, turn everything on, and I'm good to go. Before, I used to have to set up all the lights, have to set up the camera, the rig, everything. It used to be very time-consuming. 
half the time things wouldn't connect properly and it used to show oh, it used to take so long so now hopefully i can get more videos out production wise and it's a lot quicker and easier just edit straight away whoa i think i'm done now yeah hope you like it let me know in the comments if you like it um that's it. That's all I've got to say. Um, thank you very much for watching. If you like this kind of video, give a big thumbs up. If you don't, big thumbs down because it's a pile of cack. Let me know in the sec comment section what you think of it and why you think it's a piece of pish. And social links will be in the description if you want to subscribe to the channel. Please do so. And use the link in the corner of the screen there. And click the bell. Why not? If you can't click the bell... Join the subscription tab. That's what I'm saying. You want to look at the subscription tab on your mobile phone or your setup and you will see all the latest videos from all the YouTubers that you're subscribed to. Hopefully it'll be me and you'll see my latest videos there. I think that's it. Thank you very much for watching. Stay frosty. Bye-bye.